okay here we have this um, exponential equation 3 to the power of a plus 3 to the power of a equals 12 okay so how do we deal with this do not introduce log yet you can simplify it before introducing log right so to simplify um, 3 to the power of a is a common term to these two so we we'll have 1 plus 1 if you multiply this if you open the brackets you're going to have this right so this is equal to 12 now we have 3 to the power of a multiplied by 2 equals 12 since we are multiplying these two to remove one of them we can divide by the term that we want to remove so since we are removing 2 we divide both sides by 2 so 2 will go from here so 3 to the power of a is equal to 6 12 divided by 2 so this is the right time to introduce your log and you only introduce log if your 6 cannot be expressed in the base of 3 if we are having 9 here there will be no need for us to introduce logarithm okay so let's introduce our logarithm but before then 3 to the power of a is 3 times 2 because 6 is 3 times 2 now let's introduce our log log a okay that's log 3 rather to the power of a is equal to log 3 times 2 now do you remember this law log a b is the same as log a plus log b so i'm going to express this in this form so i'll write log a log 3 to the power of a first then on the other hand i have log 3 plus log 2 and again you cannot get your a if it remains the um, the power so it has to go behind according to one of the laws okay this will come here to multiply the log so we have a times log 3 equals log 3 plus log 2 now we are looking for a so we need to remove this and since we are multiplying both of them to remove is to divide by what you want to remove so we divide this by log 3 the same thing here should appear here and there so we have log 3 here this can go there so we're going to have a then this goes there again so that we have 1 plus log 2 divided by log 3 now here again we can apply change of base remember this log a okay let me use another letter log um log x over log y is the same thing as log x to base y so if i do the same this will give me log 2 to base 3 so let's start from there okay so our a now will be equal to 1 plus we have log 2 to the base of 3 and then from here again if you want to have your answer in decimal you can press your calculator to get this in decimal form but then we we are going to verify right away okay verification the original equation is um, 3 to the power of a plus 3 to the power of a equals 12 and the question is if we put this into this will it give 12 that's what we want to check so we have 3 
to the power of 1 plus log 2 to base 3 plus 3 again to the power of 1 plus log 2 to base 3. Now, before I expand this, let's talk about this law of um, indices. We have, um, if we have A, okay, I already have A in the problem, let's use um, B. If you have B to the power of C plus D, okay? Now, this is the same thing as B to the power of C times B to the power of D. Okay, one of the laws of indices. So I'm going to express this to be in this form. So we have 3 to the power of 1, just like I have b to the power of c. And then multiply by 3 again to the power of that. So we write 3 to the power of log 2 to base 3. So I'm going to have this in two places. If you like, put this in bracket, but there's addition between them. So we have 3 again to the power of 1 times 3 to the power of log 2 to base 3. So we close this up. Now 3 to the power of 3 is 3. Like you all know, then multiply by... Here again, there's another law that I want to explain. Okay. Imagine you have y having a power of log. Let's say we have log x. And this x is to have, I mean, this log x is to a particular base. If the base is the same as this right here, let's say y again. So that means that the whole of this will be equal to x. Okay. y to the power of log x to base y. Okay, because this base and this are the same, this will be equal to x. So the same thing is going to happen here. So 3 is to the, base, to the power of log 2 to base 3. The same number here. So 2 will be here. Plus, the same thing will happen there. We have 3 times 2 again. Right? So 3 times 2 is 6 plus 3 times 2 again, 6. And if you add these two, you're having 12. And if you want to remember, if you can recall, we have 3 to the power of a plus 3 to the power of a equals 12. Can you see that? So this means that we are very correct because this right here now is 6 and this again is 6. So we are correct to say that our a is equal to 1 plus log 2 to the base of 3. Thank you for watching and if you have not subscribed, do subscribe.